Hi guys, in this video I am going to create read more read less component in react.js. I have already created two video on this topic. So you can check it out from here. You can search simply read more and you will get two result. Here is the one result and you can use here or both are pure JavaScript. So there are no use of any framework and any library. You can check out this one if you want to create this type of just created with react.js so here is our output and let's get started now so here i have already created a start profile as you can see here and here is nothing much and here is our app component and here is our style file so first i am going to create one component read more read less read more and read less dot this and here we can create one arrow function read more read less and here just we want to return for now read more and read less and here we can return some text for now and here we need to import so here import default read more read less and now we can import here import read more read less and we can use here So this component we can use as many we want so here let's copy but here is the one problem is that we can't change the text so we want to create higher order component so we will provide this text like here and we can simply wrap this one at a thread and whatever we written inside we can access here by children children and here we can see children and now we can see all this text and now we want to show this text some text we want to show here and then we click on the button read more and then we want to all this text so let's take one button here so simply i am going to take button and simply for now give read more and now we can see here is our button then ever we click on this button and we can show the all the steps so here we can take one step Forms and here is read more stone or set read more stone here we can use use set and initial value we want false and here we can import our state import use state and now we will use here is is readme is true we want to show all the text so here simply we can wear children and if we don't have this is true so we can condition is false so we want to show a small text so we can simply do children and here substring substring and here we want 0 to 200 for now and now we can see and whenever we click on this button and we want to show all the text so, so now create here what 
function so take in this one and here let's toggle button simply we want this one and here simply arrow function or whatever value inside of this we want to take previous step because we want depend on the previous step so simply we can do that and here we can add one listener and here we can right toggle button and now we can click it's working fine as you can see here we can see but we want to this constant value pass from here so suppose we want here give the limit suppose limit pass 100 as the limit and we can access this limit here simply limit and we can write here limit and now we can see and here we can see button text is not changing so we can do one more thing we can write here is condition rendering so here just we want is let me more shown if it is visible so should be red less otherwise you want dot 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 red read more and so we can see here is the read more and then we click read less button is shown here and now it's looking fine we need to just refactor so it looks be really clean so just go here and we want here constant and here we can give this children and we want here text just and here we can use text and here is the limit is red and now it's looking much better and we can change whatever we want from here and let's give some start so it's more look pretty and here we can go and let's give the black body and here we want padding for two ram now that's great and we can select red more red plus here we want some background color so let's give background color as S S S S and here we want some background color too so here i want this one and we can give some box shadow box shadow zero zero one ram rgc and here give some value now here we want some padding padding one ram i hope it will look much better and give more some border radius border radius 1.5 ram and for yeah it's looking great and here we can select button so let's give button and here go and give the class name button so class name button and now we want here simply background transparent and border none and here we can want width want width 500 and here we can give color i hope and let's give one 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 and here we can 
from like this stuff and here we want cursor pointer cursor pointer and let's give some other color so it looks more so i want a sky blue sky blue i hope it looks great yeah but it's not visible so let's change some other color and you can change whatever you want it doesn't matter it depends on you uh, does look more awesome and here whatever you want to change you can change and make it as you want and here we can change whatever we want and just we need to change here limit we want suppose 200 and we can paste it is multiple time it doesn't matter just we need to use as a component and we can copy this one here and paste we can give the text and here and here i am just giving margin prop one time for now and it's looking much better than before and you can max as you want and you can style it so this is the OS i'm going to end i hope you understood this one i will meet you in next one don't forget to subscribe share and stay tuned with me i will meet you next one bye bye